the name of the exhibition is simply MUCA. Now for publications, we're using the title also MUCA and Art Nouveau, because that's the big movement he was associated with. When I design a show, I arrange things as if I'm teaching a class where I'm telling a story. In this exhibition, there is, first of all, an, an introduction. So a lot of the ideas that these European artists are, um, are using, in fact, in origin, come from Japanese prints. Muka is kind of a mainline Art Nouveau artist. He is working in the world of graphic design. He was a commercial artist. He created posters. He also designed menus for upscale restaurants in Paris. So he's really versatile. And when designing this show, what I tried to do was include things that showed his range. So you can walk through the show and see how he's evolving, how he's changing his mind about things over time. So there's kind of a general MUCA show that's, uh, uh, that's experienced when you go through the museum. Within that general story, there are a lot of small stories that record certain events that happen during his life. For example, uh, around Christmas, 1894, there is this famous actress in Paris by the name of Sarah Bernhardt, who's going to put on a play. The theater wants a nice poster made. Fortunately, Alphonse Mucha, who at the time is an unknown artist, is available. Most of the artists were out of town or it's Christmas, they don't want to do work. So he produces this poster called Gizmonda, which is the name of the play. And Sarah Bernhardt sees the poster, loves the poster, just loves this poster. Here she's depicted in an idealized way. But being an actress, this is the way she wanted to be viewed by the public. So um, she loved it. She loved this poster. And this is the event that makes Alphonse Mucha, an internationally famous artist, because Sarah Bernhardt now was behind him and commissioned him to do more work. He becomes more and more uh, famous and just uh, has all the commissions he could ever want then. So that story is part of the grand story that is told with this uh, exhibition.